Yeah, next thing I wanted to show is maybe driving with a tram line. But which tram line would be worth it? Like one who goes really through all the city, right? Let's see if we can find some. Why does it show me every line though? I don't completely understand this game sometimes. I played Transport FIFA 1, but it's everything it's a long time ago. Let's take this yellow line, guys. It's it's a little weird though, but it goes through the whole city, through all these big parts, like most of them. It begin it starts right here at Neustadt, which means new city, so Let's see new city part. Oh, look at this car go. <laughs> Things are do going well. City's growing. Let's see. I've made an experiment with the editor here. I had to push the numbers down to the... Yeah. Well, we have like 8,000 people already. We have... <laughs> yeah, 600,000 kilometers of rails. Yeah. Everything is electric. I did it here. You see, 1920. Oh my. The headquarters is doing well. 94 points. I mean, we transport like uh, 1 million... What? Okay, per per year we transport 12,800 uh, goods and almost 10,000 persons. And it grows and grows. So, I don't know why this number is always different. So if someone knows that, you can you can just write it, please explain it to me. I don't have the time to look it up, like this week. Not really. So uh, let's start with the tram here, which is the tram line number two, and it has 26 stations. It goes, yeah, uh, yeah goes from A to B and comes back, right? So let's watch it. Let's watch what the game can do, how it looks. It looks very good compared to Transport Fever 1. I mean now it's it's heavy loaded with cars. Let's see how the performance is. But maybe we could we could drive from this perspective though. We see a little bit more. We can uh, yeah look like this with the keyboard yeah so there you see some cars on the still uh, yeah some cars there 1930 so everything gets modern he almost drove into the tram what a genius look those guys with this with this uh, expensive cars I mean come on you are not God stick to the rules oh look at this they literally literally in cubing we have a system called ghost cars so <laughs> their uh, cars can go just through each other and uh, that looks ugly as well so transport fever 2 did make a good job to make this look realistic though again but yeah at least you can really uh, make your your stations uh, individually yeah some lights we see more and more lights popping up. Still old tracks though. I have to rebuild all the streets, like I said before, but I see I have some new viewers. So for the 1940 series which will come then, I really have to redo the street system and the highway system of this city because I started to build it in 1850. <laughs> and where are we though now? We are in a new, new city, so Neustadt. We are Neustadt. There we go. Like, almost no one uses it right now. Let's. What passenger is in it though? So it's sandbox mode, of course. You see, uh, <laughs> we lose 500 millions right now. Yeah. But it works. It took me two, three, four days to build it. Yeah. It's not perfect though. I I think in the middle of the year or so I will try to make it better. Uh, 
create it a better way and 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 make the series for you guys from from day one like a different project but maybe less cities because it lags and lags and try to make it perfect so we could reach a mega city in transport fever 2 so basically two people now in it why is it tram number one now it's the wrong line wait what happened what guys what happened wait 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 i took the wrong line right we wanted to go with the yellow line yeah tram two so i'm sorry guys let's start it again with the right line here the yellow line of course yeah so the ghost car effect there you see it spend a lot of millions to invent it here in cubing the cubing uh, <laughs> yeah the cubing transport uh, and yeah transport cubing transports yeah yeah my name is Cuba Cubica by the way that's my racing name here that's my internet name uh, I hope you like to watch my content uh, I'm the racecraft general by the way so I invented this racecraft league on Azeto Corsa so it would be nice if some guys would watch it and we still need some drivers so if someone drives AC watching this uh, wants to drive old legendary racing cars gentleman style hard but fair then you are more than welcome mate Azeto Corsa, Air Factor 2, breakfast we will have some Rocket League going on, we will have to some transport fever and maybe some city skylines so hope you like it yeah we go for this whole city right I mean this tram will take us directly through to the other part so that could be a long long ride so, if you like to see it from the onboard, you have to tell me in the chat, guys, because I prefer to do it like this so we can see a little bit more of this uh, crazy infrastructure here. Just massive. Yeah, it takes you two, three complete days to build it, so not recommend to do it. You will lose your family. Uh, I do it all for you, so... Just kidding, bro! So there you go, the station is a little crowded though. But it's still fluid. The more and more cars will come. The more and more things I have to invent to make it stable. So every passenger can go where he wants to. Yeah, welcome new viewers though. Nice to have some viewers. Five right now. So... go with the tram number two line it goes from the western part of the city to the eastern part of the city of this huge I can tell you just show you just this it will go <laughs> completely to the other part of the city so it's my first ride as well with this tram I have some older save games as well I will make some videos out of it how it looked like 50 years ago like in 1880 without <laughs> all these cables maybe let's see though we will evolve this series though we will go to 1940 
1950, yeah, we will see if, the, if this project is capable of running though on my PC, which is not bad, it should run. But if not, I will redo the series completely from the start, 1850s, and make it a little smaller, like take four cities out, make a smaller circle or so. So that's the whole idea. So basically the trucks are now too slow, I think, for the trams. So the trucks will need in one part of this game, like maybe when I have to redo the, the, uh, <laughs> the whole uh, street, um, will have to have an uh, own path though. I cannot go with the trams together. Right now it works, not much traffic. There you go. That's some huge buildings. 1931. I changed something on the editor, but it still shouldn't be. Yeah, okay, we are eight on 8,000 people. Yeah, yeah. So it's, it stabilizes. It, it, it was too big, I tried something. I had like 7,000 people in one city, and then I put it all back because I, yeah, it was my first experiment with the, the editor. <coughs> we can see what's the biggest cities though. So Cubing Center has 623 people already in it. it, it they all began with 100, 200 guys. Um, and the Cubing North, almost 500, here you see. That's all the cities, the cubing cities are all connected through this big circle. And the inside lines, there you see all the cities. And then new cubing, could be new, <laughs> which doesn't really, yeah, which isn't really a part of it. Uh, could be new is right here, guys. Uh, there, over there, here. Oh, we are in a city though. Let's see how it looks here. Uh, let's take it from onward in the city. Riding through cubing. What a pleasure. A uh, pleasure. How nice those city cities looked back in those days. I mean, that, that looks like a modern shop though. The like modern ages began. All these buildings switch it, switches to newer. No, uh, those are some old buildings still. There you see. Settlers, Hanson and Scott. Uh, you don't really need it, right? So you have some Walmarts now, some shops. There you go, some hotels. Some lights. Everything is new. I love this game, man. Still is very buggy though, but it's awesome. The, yeah, how you can set up your traffic line. Way better than in uh, Transport Fever One. Don't have. I mean, some some things are, are still. Some things are not good, like changing the cars and stuff. It could be easier, but yeah. Like yeah. Wait, what? Why is the truck here standing? What is wrong? Is there a station for the truck? Oh yeah, there's a station for the truck. Okay, got it. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. Those train drivers, they were trained uh, by cubing in uh, traffic systems uh, to drive as close as they can to the front guy. So that's basically why you see the car uh, so near. It was considered to be uh, the most safe way. Just uh, leave it like that. So we are in cub Cubing West Center. So it's Cubing West Center. It's not really, I have to change those names though. The, they are on the railway stations, they have the right names. But here I didn't look into it. I want to have the right names of course as well. At some point of the series. 
no, goes to under cubing city so yeah, there you go. But it is somewhere in cubing city west, though. Oh, he waited. I thought we would have the ghost car effect. But no. There you go, they wait for each other now. Well educated drivers, there you see. Wait. <laughs> oh my. Yeah, now we go to the... This is east. So in front you see the east. So we go to the... Yeah, along connect the city which connects uh, basically Cubing City West with Cubing... I mean with Cubing West with Cubing City West and then Cubing City Center it should be. There are more, uh, more streets like this though. But this is one of the main connection roads between the parts of the cities and I hope it will grow where the green is though. But the grass is so we will see more buildings through the years in this part. Like basically my first project with this uh, game. I just started it and made the base for this huge city. Oh, they never wait here on each other. They always drive into each other. But anyway. Oh look! Look at this beautiful lady. You want to come in? You want to take a ride? Please enjoy. Oh, you are not waiting for us, ma'am. Ma'am. She's not responding. So, so have a nice time. Bye. And she was dressed in black. Maybe someone died in the family. Yeah, it's a city. You know, weird things happen. People die fast. They get born fast. Oh, <laughs> you know what I mean. Anyway. It looks pretty good. I mean, the game itself. I could perfect everything though, but uh, that's not will be not the case, but I will perfect some things. Uh, it will take a long time, guys. It's huge. There you go. Just didn't wait for the green. Just anticipate and, and go for it. So the tram drivers are well educated. There you see a train from, uh, waiting. Some stuff on it. Wait. Yeah, I could place those tram lines differently at the those tram and... Yeah, uh, how you say? <laughs> those halts here. Those stations, I could place them differently. Ah, beautiful view on the, on the trains. There you see the cargo lines. Some newer cars. The cars get better and faster. People can buy them. I mean, still 31 or something. 1932, 31. So, so we are basically in Cubing Center almost. Let's take a look where we are. Yep, we just reached Cubing Center now. So that's that's the that should be the biggest city you see on the left side. Oh. That looked ugly, what the tram did, though. Yeah, that's Cubing Center. So we made it to the middle. This looks very crowded though. It 
looks very crowded the station but it should be the most crowded it's the center everything comes together here Yeah, it should be considered a let's drive, not a let's play, right? Maybe. <laughs> like, let's go through, through this stupid idea to make the biggest city transport feeder. People are using these lines. There you go, three people in it. It's not that bad. It was better in the 80, uh, 1880s. No one used it as I built it. I think the tram line is, is dead old already. There you go. There's a big center. Some big buildings already in the 30s, guys. Now it goes to the north, just crosses a little, so north is, where, we, where are we, here, yeah, yeah, it just goes north now, I think, and goes there, it will take some weird line, right now, so it's still cubing center, that's the big building we saw from the other side, it's nice. Develops more and more. Oh, that's the headquarters, guys. There you see. You see this building with this green, uh, with this green roof. That's the, the headquarters. Right there. Oh, it lags. What is wrong here? Why do, do you lag here? What is wrong? Oh my. Oh wow, something is very wrong here. What what is the case here? In ce in center it always lags. I mean, probably because it's of people or what? I mean, almost no one is using this and it lags here. It's a good. Probably have probably have to take the. That's the main station, guys. That's just the main, uh, yeah, the main station of this whole project. It has, it has the new, it has the new look already. The modern, all others are still old, I think. Uh, some are renewed, but it lags here on this station. It lags like crazy. Why? We could go on two times though. But it takes away this whole taking part in this ride. center transfer it's called here it's basically where the is it the cargo station or is it the s-bahn we call it in germany the s-bahn station the region re regional train station wait for this lady i train them to wait for ladies here, lots of tracks meeting here in center of course, that's where the traffic will be, will occur first and heavy.
that's the highway. I've, no, that's just a bridge. Yeah, where are we now? You know? It's so big. I don't. I never know. Oh, still in center. Oh yeah, going through this, uh, through this big tunnel here to the other part. Let's see, to the eastern part, more eastern connected. And right. little wobbles here. Let me see here. More connections. The central station. There we are in City East. City Ost, so that means City East, guys. Well, this language is not, not that difficult, I have to say. German and English, I mean, it's pretty similar. It has the same roots, from what I know. Yeah. And what? Oh. They are nicely dressed in those times. Accurate. <laughs> yeah, if you like, guys, don't forget to follow or like. I'm new to Twitch. I can you like here in some way? We have a YouTube channel as well, so all these highlights will be on the YouTube channel. So uh, it's called Racecraft Legends everywhere. Almost every big social media apparatus you will find Racecraft Legends. So yeah, it would be nice, guys. If someone would like to join for racing as well. Who likes Assetto Corsa and is a fair, good, fast driver? You can just join. tram right now. That's sad. It takes a long time for this train to arrive, right? For this tram. I mean, whew, maybe I did it too big. I mean, it should be that big, no? It's a huge mega city. Should be ridiculously big, and that's what it is. It is ridiculously big. Still in the 1930s. Still stone bridges almost everywhere. Have to redo them. A lot of. The most. For the speeds. So the trains can reach speeds. Uh, cars. Where does it go now? It 
will stop somewhere here. Yeah, it will stop here. Okay. So we will make a complete round around cubing east. And then I think we will go to the ferry. We will take a trip with the ferry and maybe one plane as well. So get prepared and buckle up guys. So we are 1931 still. Um, yeah, I, uh, I did it very slow. The date is just half the speed. So it will just be slowly pro proceeding. Yeah, east is crowded as well. So this north, west, south, east and central, those are the big points where everything meets. For every new newer, if someone is here, I can show you the overlay here a bit. It goes north up to Richmond here. So this is basically the whole city. Yeah, that's the ghost car effect you saw. We practice this in cubing to the cubing tram school. And then cubing uh, cargo and truck school as well. So it's a ghost car effect on the on the stations here. Go, tram number two takes us right. This is tram number two as well, but this is the it's coming back already, so it's going the other way. I'm pretty sure. Or is it it? There was the number two on it, right? And there we go. Another big city cubing east. Trains everywhere, webs everywhere. It's just